Alright, hi everyone, this is Daniel from blogboarder.com and in today's video is level transition. Let's get this character from one level to the next. Let's go. First I gotta make another level. Not open level. New level. Uh, let's save it. I'm gonna call it L2. Okay. Let's go back to the first level. Okay, now in here you gotta put a box collision in, so when your character triggers this invisible box, it will send them to the next level. So let's um, create that box trigger. So let's call it, so first blueprint actor, then call it um, next level. Call it whatever you want. <laughs> Actually, sorry. <laughs> Next level, uh, okay, one to two. Enter. Uh, open it up. Add component um, box collision. Um, I always drag it over the scene route. I'm just gonna mess with the scale just to make it a little bigger really quickly. We're gonna scale it up in the game. Um, okay, I don't want a hidden game right away. I want to see it. Or no, we do want a hidden game. Sorry, never mind. We're going to leave it hidden in game because we got that door there. Okay, so scroll down. Uh, component begin overlap. Uh, drag out and um, cast to your character. So this is the third person character. Third person character. Whatever your character is named. Um, okay, after that, open level. Open level by name. And then um, we got to get the name exact. What did I call it again? Um, cripes, hold on one sec, sorry. L2. Tuh. Okay. If you had a big long name, just go rename and then control C so you get it exact. But I can remember L2. Well, no, obviously I can't. <laughs> Okay, compile and save that, and then we just gotta put it into the level. So, uh, let's get out of here. Now where is it? It is in content. One sec, sorry. Okay, there you go. Drag it out. Okay. So now it's, well, here, you scale it to whatever you want, I guess. Make it right on the door. Okay, so now when the character goes there, he'll transfer to the next level. But first, let's get that, um, let's go back in here really quickly to the viewport. Um, okay. Not visible. Compile and save. Now, uh, let's just play. So now this should send us to the next level when we go into that box. Please work. Hey, it worked. <laughs> and that's how you do a level transition. <laughs> Have a good day, everyone.